brothers and sisters, many people have already started talking, doing analysis. Oh, don't be too late. In 2019, towards the end of 2019, if you remember, I told us what God spoke to me clearly, that the world is going to go through. I've been keeping this clear breakdown, but I'm going to tell you why I'm saying it out now. The world is going to go through seven years, seven years of judgment. And every year will increase in intensity. It will be in increasing order. So those people who were asking me, how did you know that what will happen in 2020? When I started telling people that uh, um, you're not going to be able to do certain things anymore. <laughs> and uh, now you know where it came from. Okay, in increasing order. And that this started in 2019. Again, hear me now, this is spiritual counting. Because if I tell you seven years from 2019, you will think it is 2026. No, it is 2025. 2019 was year one. 2020, year two. 2021, which we are, is year three. 2022 is year four. Uh, 2023, 20, uh, year five. 2024, year six. 2025, year seven, right? Let's count it again. 2019. 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025. It's important. I'm counting this so you don't miss it. What will happen after 2025? I don't know. 2020, as I summarized it, year of fear and panic. 2021, shock. Institutional failure, where the schemes of men will be toppled. Now, Men will continue to create various schemes. So right now they are cooking up a scheme that will throw another, the word that was given to me as I pray on this is roller coaster. It will throw the world into a roller, roller coaster. That's the characteristic of 2022, roller coaster. The men are cooking up a scheme. All these are the judgments that will continue to happen. So they will continue, like I said, and it will continue to roll us up, roll us down like that. And many lives will continue to go. But those who abide in Christ, that's the key for you and I. God said he will give us victory. He will protect his own and he will keep us for his will. And now we're going to pray. Raise your voices with me then and tell him, Father God, I thank you for keeping me in the year 2021 alive. Thank you for your word that you gave to us. And your word is true. That this year, you will give us victory. We thank you. You have given us victory. And we commit every second, every minute, every hour, every day remaining in year 2021 into your hand. Lord God Almighty, take charge over our lives. Take charge over all the nations of the earth. And let all your will and your purpose for year 2021 be fulfilled. Heavenly Father, keep us in the hollow of your hand. Jesus, the true vine, we abide in you as you have said. He that abides in you will not be moved, will not be shaken. Let us not be shaken. And so, Lord, we ask that you will keep us to see the end of year 2021. And you will cross us into the year 2022. And Lord, we pray that in that year 2022, roller coaster experience. Lord, you have spoken that we will enjoy abundant life. We pray that that abundant life in Christ Jesus be granted us. Go before us, O God, and make year 2022 our year of enjoying God's abundant life in Christ Jesus. Thank you, our Father. Thank you, our Lord. Thank you, our King. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. Thank you, our Father. Do you be all glory? Glory. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen.